The Thomas B. Jeffery Company was an American automobile manufacturer in Kenosha, Wisconsin from 1902 until 1916. The company manufactured the Rambler and Jeffery brand motorcars. It was preceded by the Gormley and Jeffery Manufacturing Company, a bicycle manufacturer. It was the parent company to Nash Motors, thus one of the parent companies of American Motors and Chrysler. Thomas B. Jeffery Thomas B. Jeffery was an inventor and an industrialist. He was one of America's first entrepreneurs interested in automobiles in the late 19th century. In 1897, he built his first prototype motorcar. Thomas B. Jeffery was serious enough about automobiles to sell his stake in Gormley and Jeffery to the American Bicycle Company to finance the new car company. Topic business Charles T. Jeffery's Thomas's son experimental prototypes of 1901 models A and B used at least two radical innovations, steering wheels and front-mounted engines. By the time Charles was ready for production in 1902, his father had talked him out of these wild dreams and convinced him to stick with tillers and engines under the seat. From 1902 until 1908, Jeffery moved steadily to bigger, more reliable models starting with the 1902 Model C. Jeffery cars were built on assembly lines the second manufacturer to adopt them, Ransom E. Olds was first, and in 1903 Jeffery sold 1,350 Ramblers. By 1905, Jeffery more than doubled this number. One reason may have been because Charles went back to the steering wheel before 1904. In 1907, Jeffery was building a large variety of different body styles and sizes. Among them was a five-passenger, $2,500 Rambler weighing 2,600 pounds and powered by a 40-horsepower engine. In April, 1910, Thomas B. Jeffery, died in Pompeii, Italy and in June of that year the business was incorporated under the name of the Thomas B. Jeffery Company, with Charles T. Jeffery as the President and General Manager, H. W. Jeffery, Vice President and Treasurer. In 1915, Charles T. Jeffery, changed the automotive branding from Rambler to Jeffery to honor the founder, his father, Thomas B. Jeffery. As of 1916, G. H. Eddy replaced H. W. Jeffery as the treasurer so H. W. Jeffery could focus on the position of vice president. G. W. Greiner was the secretary, L. H. Bill the general manager, J. W. Deku the factory manager, and Al Rick was the sales manager. Charles T. Jeffery survived the sinking of the RMS Lusitania a British luxury liner torpedoed by the Germans in World War I in 1915 and decided to spend the rest of his life in a more enjoyable manner. Charles W. Nash, no longer at General Motors, saw an opportunity and bought the Thomas B. Jeffery Company in August 1916. Topic the factory Jeffery, with the money from his sale of Gormley and Jeffery, bought the old Sterling Bicycle Company's factory in Kenosha, Wisconsin. The original factory building was only 600 by 100 feet 183 by 30 meters in size. However, by 1916, the company's buildings expanded over 20 acres 8 hectares under roof and the facilities had grown to over 100 acres 40 hectares including a test track. Topic: Jeffrey Quad. 
The Jeffrey Quad, also known as the Nash Quad or Quad is a four-wheel drive truck that was developed and built in Kenosha from 1913, and after 1916, by Nash Motors, as well as under license by other truck makers. The Quad introduced numerous engineering innovations. Its design and durability proved effective in traversing the muddy, rough, and unpaved roads of the times. The Quad also became one of the effective work vehicles in World War I. The Quad was also one of the first successful four wheel drive vehicles ever to be made, and its production continued unchanged through 1928, or 15 years, with a total of 41,674 units made. Topic timeline 1897 Jeffrey builds a rear-engine Rambler prototype using the Rambler name previously used on a highly successful line of bicycles made by Gormley and Jeffrey. 1899 Positive reviews at the 1899 Chicago International Exhibition and Tournament and the first National Automobile Show in New York City prompt the Jefferies to enter the automobile business. 1900 December 6, Thomas B. Jeffrey finalizes a $65,000 deal to buy the Kenosha, Wisconsin, factory of the defunct Sterling Bicycle with money from the sale of his interest in Gormley and Jeffrey. 1901 Two more prototypes, models A and B, are made. 1902 First production Ramblers, the $750 Model C open runabout and the $850 Model D the same car with a folding top. Both are powered by an 8 horsepower 6 kilowatts, 8 PS, 98 cubic inch 1 L 1 cylinder engine mounted beneath the seat, and are steered by a right side tiller. First year production totals 1,500 units making Jeffrey the second largest car maker behind Oldsmobile. 1910 March 21, Thomas B. Jeffrey dies while on vacation in Italy. 1910 June 10, Charles incorporates the firm as a $3 million $78,921,429 in 2017 dollars public stock company. 1914 The Rambler name is replaced with the Jeffrey moniker in honor of the founder. 1916 August, Charles Jeffery sells the company to former General Motors Corp. President Charles W. Nash. 1917 Charles Nash renames the Jeffery Motor Company, Nash Motors after himself. <laughs> Notes External links 1916 Advertisement for Jeffrey Quad, p. 481 Schematic drawing of Jeffrey Quad chassis Data sheet for Armored Car No. 1 U.S. Army, build on Jeffrey Quad chassis at Rock Island Arsenal, 1916 Photo of armored rear drive Jeffrey truck not a quad